and name that lust demon is very powerful. I don't understand how women in church can tell men about Jesus and she half naked. Still showing cleavage. You can't tell that man about Jesus and you still just a seductor. You're bringing on temptation. The time for church is to live holy. How can you say you an evangelist and dressing like Jezebel and got a wide split? So when you have the Holy Ghost, the Holy Ghost will tell you, cover your body. Cover that. Pull out that dress that's too short. The Holy Ghost do more than just make it jump and shout. But the Holy Ghost will tell you how to dress holy. We're living in days when women are showing breasts even in Hollywood. Praise the Lord because the devil requires lust. Because he wants us to be lustful and commit adultery and, and fornication. Was God is against adultery. He's against fornication. And Jesus said the lust at the woman of your heart, you already committed adultery. Sometimes that's easier said than done because you got lust all around you. The devil tries to make it hard. But give your mind to Jesus Christ. Put on the helmet of salvation. Hallelujah. And say, I'm determined to live holy. It's not easy living holy. You're surrounded by lust. The devil got even half-naked women even in the church sitting on the pulpit talking about she an evangelist. How you an evangelist and looking like Jezebel seducing the pastor and know you got a husband and know the pastor got a wife and yet you chasing after another woman's husband or another man's wife. Many of you pastors need to sit down and say, Lord, forgive me for my sins and stop being a playboy. You can't be a playboy, pastor. God bless you, young man of God. I'm happy to see you this morning. Praise the Lord. You can't be a playboy, pastor. Go around seducing another man's wife, and you already got a wife. How are you going to preach the gospel, and you're not living right yourself? We got to practice what we preach, and not be a playboy. Hallelujah, not be a pimp in the pulpit. Hallelujah, God requires holiness. Hallelujah, he loves you, he loves you, but let's love him back. Whoa, hallelujah, stop being a child molester. Child molesters are going to hell. Up in the Roman Catholic churches, if you're raping little children, if you don't repent, you're going to hell. Hell is real, just like heaven is real. Hallelujah.